and then I'll come back here hopefully at some stage in the future and all will be revealed. But there's uh, predictions yeah. inside here about the three of you and I also about uh, potentially <laughs> again uh, twins by the way <laughs> it does happen. That goes inside the sealed now UPS bubble wrapped bag and the three of you sign that and you'll hold on to it here. Is Make sure it can't be switched and any yeah, you can it anywhere you want, I don't mind. There we go. Okay. A little surprise for you. Wow. I'm kind of scared. Yeah, I'm very scared. Yeah. And there's details in there about Bernard's weight as well. So you need to weigh yourself today and then in the future when I come back. Oh my God. Okay. Brilliant. And come here, Keith, tell us. Tell, tell us. <laughs> so the, uh, one of my favourite um, b- uh, bits you do was the spikes over the paper yeah. mugs. Like, I love watching that, right? I hate, I'm never going to do that. Mm. But I love that. So, but this brain hacker thing, to, is it slightly moving away from the more... Is it, is, is it more kind of like um, mentalist or something? Yeah, yeah. Well, I, I mean, we can do something real quick. I wasn't really thinking, but uh, well, we can do, we'll we try something real quick. Let's um, do it. It's up to you. Yeah, have, yeah. have you ever heard of a, a first and favourites book? No. Okay, this is for socially retarded people. Basically, people, <laughs> That's me. people who go to a, <laughs> people who go to a, a party, all right? Now, they've got no social skills at all. You right. get one of these. I, I mean, this is something people should do. What you do is you make one up yourself. It's just a little notebook. And it has all first and favourites in. So, for example, uh, it says, I'll let you read it out, gents. Everybody knows that they're all different. What does that one say? Uh, favourite experience. Favourite experience, this one? First horror movie. Favourite TV show? Favourite time of the day. <laughs> favourite food. First uh, expensive purchase. First book. Okay, so there's about 60 of them here, okay? So the idea is that you make this up at a party. You get somebody to select one at random. Uh, I'm looking at uh, first kiss. So then everybody would start talking about their first kiss. So it's a topic of conversation. So we'll do this with you, Jen, right now. Here's what I want you to do. In a moment, I'll give you the little booklet face down. As we can see, once again, there's about, I don't know, 60 of them in here. First house number, favorite name, lots of them. You're going to hold a face down like this. You'll pull up with your thumb, okay? And then whatever one that you see, I want you to go back to that memory, okay? So if it's your first kiss, you'll go back to your first kiss and so on. So take it, pull up with your thumb, okay? And then look at one. Don't let me see it. Don't let anybody else see it. Okay, have you got one? Quickly. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Put the elastic band around it. I'm not going to touch anything. Just so everybody out there listening knows, and we can get rid of that. Good. So, uh, Bernard, at this moment in time, have you any idea of what memory Jen is thinking of? Just yes or no? Yes. Oh, you do. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead. What do you think it is? I think it's her first kiss. Is it your first kiss? Just yes or no? No. No. She did go there for a second in her mind, but whatever this is, look at me. I want you to go back to that moment in time. You're happy there's no way anybody here could know this memory. Agreed? Yeah, no. There's no way anybody No. Know. Okay, look at me. Focus on this memory. Focus on whether you're alone or there's people. First, first, focus on whether it's a first or a favorite, okay? Um, this is definitely, I would say, a first rather than a favorite. I'm also sensing that it was uh, quite an... Oh, she's trying to throw me off now by shifting her body language. That's good. Uh, there was other people there, uh, mainly female, I would say, because uh, I'm seeing lots of different heads around. I'm seeing lots of skirts. Focus on this. I focus... Oh, I see something a large kind of behind you. I can hear a bell, a large grey object behind you. It's like a building that's grey, a dull grey building. It needs kind of a good lick of paint. I'm hearing bells in the background. Uh, I'm seeing green, lots of green. And lots Shut of green, up. and uh, <laughs> lots of green, lots of green, and lots of kind of checked, checked skirts. Lots of green, uh, a big grey building behind you, uh, and something to do with. And not a, initially, Margaret came to mind, but that could be somebody else belonging to you. So Margaret or, or Mary or somebody. <laughs> My first day at secondary school in St. Mary's, where I had a green uh, jumper and a, a pleated green uh, really? skirt. Yeah, St. Oh. Mary's in Valdonis. Think about my first day at school. Oh. 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 That was exactly like my first day at school. <laughs> keithbarry.com or mcd.ie or Ticketmaster for tickets and April 1st in the Olympia for 14 nights and Can't all wait. around the country as well I'm in the Forum in Waterford tomorrow night brilliant thanks very much Keith Barry everyone Yay! 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 Yay!